Hi, I'm Tom. I'm the product manager for the plugins team at the Foundry, and I'd like to show you around our new plugin, Rolling Shutter. It's designed to help correct the skew and distortion the CMOS chip in some modern digital cameras can create. The problem arises as there's a slight delay between the camera recording the top and the bottom of the picture. This time difference means that movement in the scene can end up distorted. You can see the trouble here in a shot where the camera is panning sideways. Not only can it look odd, but it makes shots difficult or time consuming to track. Our plugin, available for After Effects and Nuke, attempts to correct for this distortion by working out the motion in the scene and sliding objects back into their proper place. Being able to correct for this not only helps the look of the shot, but it can also allow you to extract the camera from a previously untrackable shot. Unlike some other global solutions, our technology allows us to look at each of the moving objects in the scene individually and move them back to the right place, rather than applying a global skew to the whole image. This stops any objects that weren't actually moving relative to the camera being distorted by the correction process. The main piece of information you need in order to use the plugin is how much lag there is in your camera. The easiest way to work this out is to film a, a little test shot uh, where you pan your camera around a scene with some quite strong vertical edges, maybe a wall or a door. You simply apply the plugin and adjust the correction amount till the vertical lines in the shot that are bending are straight again. Once you know the value, which is the time in frames from the top to the bottom of the image, you can reuse it for any shot from that camera, assuming that the camera doesn't change. By setting correction to the negative equivalent, you can also use the plugin to add distortion to a clean plate. Rolling Shutter is currently available for Nuke and After Effects CS3 and CS4 from our website.